every I watched the introductory um, thing, which I think was the uh, treasure hunt. And basically everything that you were saying, I was like, oh my God, that's exactly what I was thinking. So I just knew that I had to take the course. It was just everything really resonated with me. And for things like I wanted to work on having a more positive mindset and letting things kind of like happen instead of trying to control everything. So all of those things kind of resonated with me and I want to be a part of it. What were some of your favorite results that you garnered for yourself, whether they were tangible or intangible? What did you walk away with? I think just being more aware of like what I was doing and like how I have pushed down feelings. Like a lot of the time, my husband is kind of the opposite where like when he was feeling things and like being sad about stuff, he's like, what's wrong with you? Why are you sad? Like, I just never, I always thought that I needed to be happy all the time. So I think just like, bringing that to light and like finding out like some of these things are not okay that I need to work on you know that um, I think just like becoming more self-aware overall of the way that I was acting or certain things I was doing and and also like figuring out how to change them with like para so I'm still like working through things a lot of the time and it's, it's been really helpful with like my kids too with just like pausing for a minute instead of like yelling at them. So I'm, I'm working through that um, too. So that's been really helpful. Yeah. That, I was going to ask, how has that awareness kind of rippled into specific buckets of your life where you see some changes? Yeah, I think just like I, the relationship I have with my mom and sister also is something that like you kind of like talked to and touched on and a lot of other people um, in the course as well. So I think with that, like sometimes I just don't, I'm not as defensive with them as I usually was. And that starts like whole big things. So I think that's something where I just like, I, you know, kind of like keep it to myself and like, it might upset me, but like, I, I kind of think about like, is it really worth it for me to even say anything? So I just, usually I would just like say whatever I wanted in every single situation and not think about the consequences. <laughs> and that wasn't always good for me. So I've been just thinking more before I talk or act. Yeah. If you were describing mind over matter to someone who maybe saw it and they're like considering it, how would you describe the program? I mean, I loved it. Like, I think being like a part of the live classes was really something that worked well for me. And like, I also have a full-time job, so I would do it like during work and like have my phone down. But I, I think just the live classes were so helpful, like the community, like, I think that any, everyone should definitely do it because there's just so many things that have really benefited me in my life. And though I'm still like working through things. I now have these tools that I think are going to help me and just like a better, a different outlook, like a different perspective on the way that I looked at my life overall. So I think that that was really helpful as well. 